here with Gozo Plays. Hope you guys are doing awesome. Today we're going to be checking out Yanfei and going through all the material that you'll need for her ascension. We're going to start off at the character page and you're just going to pop up to the top right hand corner here and click on the ascension materials preview page and this is where you can preview everything that you're going to be needing for her ascension as well as picking up those fates for ascending her. So let's start out with this Agnidas Agate. You're going to need one of the slivers, nine fragments, as well as chunks and six of the gemstones and we're just going to get those mostly from this pyro regis vine boss just do a little pew pew and then you'll need that 40 resin at the end to open up the trounce blossom and get your goodies next up we're going to look at this juvenile jade which you'll be needing 46 of and that is just off of our primo geovishap boss which is just located here in tianqiu valley just navigate them on out pop on over there um, great boss for shields to help reduce a lot of that incoming damage he does hit like a truck so just finish him off and again 40 resin to open up that trounce blossom and I get those juvenile jade and next up we're gonna look at the Noctilucus Jade which you'll need 168 of here are some of my infographics for this I will drop them in the comments below as well and we're gonna go through all of the different locations here, and um, I will be back after that. So get okay. lost sometimes, and I can't seem to find a light between the walls I built for myself, right in my mind. And then you came over and you showed me love that I never had seen before. And now, when I got you, it's all gonna be alright. Thinking about all the things. Tonight, what a time to be alive Just you and I Just you and I
Now to check out the insignias, you'll need 18 of the Treasure Hoarder, 30 of the Silver Raven, and 36 of the Golden Raven. And you can just navigate these on out by heading up to your Adventurer's Handbook here. Enemies, searching for easy enemies, and then they're just on the bottom here just navigate them on out it'll pop up on your map and you can kind of rinse and repeat this until you're out of treasure hoarders and then just pop over there kick some bad guy butt and pick up your loot at the end another great way to farm these is through the different ley lines um, as they do spawn these quite frequently I'll pop a link below to which ley lines spawn which enemies that way it's just a little bit more efficient for farming these guys out and you don't need to open the ley line at the end to pick up all this loot next up we're gonna take a quick peek at her talents and you will all be needing these gold talent books which are at the Tashin mansion on Wednesday and Saturday as well as more insignias <laughs> so you'll be farming lots of treasure hoarders and this domain is just located over in Zhuyang Karst here and again Wednesday and Saturday as well as optional Sunday. Lastly for her higher talent materials you will need these blood jade branches and that's going to be off of our new weekly boss Azdaha. Um, he's definitely a little bit more on the difficult side more. here um, so you're going to want to bring a lot more shielding characters here um, because when Today, he does this you are reckoning. going to get hit by a ton of elemental damage um, if you are not shielded. I will have all and that is pretty much it for me guys hopefully you should be able to ascend your Yanfei and do be aware that she is going to increase her pyro damage bonus um, when you're ascending her anyways hopefully you found this video helpful if you did make sure to give us a big thumbs up and definitely consider subscribing if you haven't already we would love to see it in all of our upcoming Genshin content until then guys take care Sometimes